Hi everyone, thanks for joining me again today. It's Mitch from Smart PE, and today I'm going to be looking at a smarter way to answer this short answer question on the Golden Triangle. Now, as always, we've got our five steps at the top that we like to follow. So let's read the question carefully first. Then looking to highlight and fully understand the command word, and the command word is often the first word of the sentence. And the first word here is what, and what means to name or identify. Then looking to highlight our topic words, then I can highlight our qualifier words, so we're going to be linking our answer to. And finally, we're looking to highlight the amount of marks that are available, just to make sure we make enough points in our answer. Once I've done that, I now need to think which assessment objective is being questioned here. And what being name or identify type questions, when linked to a definition like in this particular situation, pretty much, we know that this is going to be mostly AO1 or recall type um, types of questions. Now we know the golden triangle is made up of three different components. So what's really important when I answer this question is that I address each three component. And it might even be worth throwing a definition in there as well as to what the golden triangle actually is, just to make sure you fully access or give yourself the best chance of accessing the three marks that are available. Use your smart card to help you if you're not sure on some of the content. And as always, make sure you answer this question Mark it and check your answer yourself.